We're going to be seeing more of them later on tonight. Before we meet the class of 2013, it is my great honor to introduce the chairman and CEO of Great Minds in STEM who will introduce tonight's first host sponsor. Please welcome the one and only, the charming, the debonair, the man himself, Mr. Ray Mayathel. I'm just a little taller than Belita. <laughs> Thank you, Belita. We are so honored to have you back. I want to take just a second to thank everyone here tonight, our winners, our sponsors, and all of our conference attendees. To reiterate what Belita said earlier, it took all of you, our winners, our sponsors, our many champions across the country to achieve this milestone. So on behalf of our board of directors, Anna Park, and the whole GMIS team, I'd like to thank and congratulate you for this achievement. I especially want to thank our 25-year founding sponsors who have been with us since the beginning. We're going to meet one of them right now. You know, 1989 was a big year for us here at GMIS, but was also a big year for Northrop Grumman. That was the year the B-2 Spirit bomber first took to the skies. The design of the B-2 was so revolutionary, no one really knew how well it would work the flying wing shape and radar absorbing material had never been successful on a production plane before. But Northrop Grumman rolled the dice. They assigned an engineer named Jorge Diaz to be the chief engineer on the B-2. And it was his team that got the plane off the ground for the first time in 1989. Jorge Diaz, of course, is now a member of our Hall of Fame. It shouldn't be a surprise Northrop Grumman bet big on a bold, new, unproven design for the B-2 Spirit. Because that same year, they bet big on a bold, new organization called HENAC. And today, the B-2 Spirit is an icon of the skies, familiar to friend and foe alike. And Northrop Grumman is one of the great minds in STEM, most faithful partners. Let's, yes sir, let's get that around. They are. Let's take a look at a short video. ¿Qué tiene que ver la ética con volar al doble de la velocidad del sonido? ¿Qué tiene que ver la integridad con superar los retos más difíciles? ¿O la responsabilidad con establecer un nuevo récord mundial? ¿Qué tiene que ver cualquiera de estas cosas con la eficacia? Todo. Porque en Northrop Grumman son nuestros valores los que nos permiten llevar nuestro trabajo hasta los niveles más altos. De hecho, son la razón por la cual podemos utilizar la innovación para hacer todo más accesible y más avanzado para nuestros clientes. Es por ello que podemos alcanzar y sobrepasar las expectativas de nuestros accionistas, no solo a nivel financiero, sino también ético. Es por ello que podemos atraer a los mejores empleados del mundo y conservarlos. Y es por ello que podemos hacer lo que decimos que vamos a hacer. Para nosotros, el valor de la eficacia es más que un eslogan. Es un objetivo de la más alta importancia que conduce a toda nuestra empresa hacia el éxito. Porque sabemos que lo que hacemos afecta a la seguridad de nuestra nación y de todo el mundo. Y eso nos ha ayudado a convertirnos en verdaderos líderes de On-Man Systems, Seguridad Ciber, C4 ISR y Logística. ¿Qué tienen que ver los valores en Northrop Grumman con la eficacia y el rendimiento? Todo. Ese es el valor de la eficacia. Our culture and our background is important, isn't it? And our technology needs to be global. But now, ladies and gentlemen, it is my distinct pleasure to welcome the Chairman, Chief Executive Officer, President of Northrop Grumman, Corporation, but more importantly, my friend, Wes Bush.
Well, thank you, Ray. Wow. Even with the bright lights here, I can tell this is an amazing turnout. I'm really pleased to be here. It's wonderful join, to join all of you for this tremendous event and to represent the more than 65,000 employees who comprise Northrop Grumman and make it such a great place to work. We're honored to serve as the lead sponsor of this year's HENAC Gala and to help recognize all the important work of this organization and its members. Ray, thank you for your excellent leadership of Great Minds in STEM. You are a true Hall of Famer, and Northrop Grumman is so fortunate to have been able to work with you and partner with Great Minds in STEM since its inception a quarter century ago. Our company, and I'll say our industry, together we are committed to a diverse and inclusive workplace for all of our employees. First, because without it, we cannot generate the great innovation that we need to fulfill our industry's mission of ensuring technological superiority for our great nation. To achieve that goal of being great innovators, every individual needs to feel free to bring his or her own experiences and perspectives to the workplace. Because the more diverse the group, the wider the base of ideas will be across the team. Diverse thinking and an inclusive environment generate better ideas and foster stronger team commitment, collaboration, and engagement. And these, in turn, power the performance that delivers value to our customers and shareholders, our employee team, and to our communities. The second reason we're so committed to diversity is because a diverse and inclusive workplace makes our industry more attractive to a broad array of valuable talent in a very competitive business environment. Companies like Northrop Grumman must compete keenly for every talented person seeking a place to spend their professional lives. Creating a diverse and inclusive environment is essential for attracting, retaining, and developing top talent. And it's critical for Northrop Grumman to sustain our performance culture. For these reasons, we see great minds in STEM as invaluable. Their objective is to motivate, to enlighten, and to inspire young people in underserved communities toward fulfilling useful lives in the areas so important to our nation's future, science, technology, engineering, and math. It's an objective that fits perfectly with the needs of our industry and of our nation. Tonight, we will see what can come of motivation and inspiration when applied to young minds. The HENAC Awards recognize professional journeys that began in youthful motivation and inspiration. And because motivation begets motivation, and inspiration begets inspiration, the awards conferred tonight are more than deserved recognition of worthy individuals. They are important signals to the youth of today that they are free to dream of receiving their own rewards tomorrow. It's my hope that we, you will all find motivation and inspiration in the lives, the accomplishments, and the journeys of the remarkable individuals we will honor tonight. Thank you for being here. Let's begin our ceremony this evening. Thank you, everyone.